like and subscribe the channel please like and subscribe the channel in this video i'm going to share you what's new in the microsoft intune so you already heard about this new uh, apple declarative device management so in the in the you can say uh, it's um, it's a gdm right so earlier you heard about this mdm uh, now you apple has released the apple declarative device management which is actually new that make devices more autonomous so this is actually very hot topic in mdm spaces space and now uh, it's thinking that uh, mdm gonna replace or it's uh, or or this protocol actually give uh, apple device management uh, and this is the future of the mdm i mean the next version of mdm so what is uh, actually proactive and reactive mdm protocol and this the former actually the former or which we version of the mdm protocol we took a reactive approach right when a mdm sent a command to a M managed devices uh, multiple exchanges between the device and the mdm server took place to apply the, the single profile or change right for mdm to detect the change that occur on the device itself such as ios update the mdm has to poll the devices for the information rather than the devices automatically notifying the mdm okay while the ddm declarative device management is an updated proactive it's rather than the reactive it's a proactive version designed to be more lightweight for the server and allow devices more autonomy so you can say the devices can respond to the changes in state and apply the additional logic based on those changes so without prompting from the mdm server a, a devices can notify the mdm server where certain changes occur so it's actually proactive right and there are actually three 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 stages of declarative device management so the first is declaration right so how you can convey the policy and then second is configuration third is the assets right so and then activation so uh, the benefits of declarative device management is like is the enhanced end user experience proactivity increased reliability closer device monitoring through the updates reduce network bandwidth users right instead of sending or polling uh, the devices from the server it's reducing it will reduce the network bandwidth lower complexity upon polling for faster onboarding and the improved managed software updates so the last one i am thinking about this i can say you the improved software updates so you see my screen declarative device management improved software only microsoft is in tune is also a uh, in tune team is ex also excited about this improvement apple has made about this software update experience this is actually we all being as admin we are looking and now it's available in microsoft in tune and this capability enable admin to time software update to minimize interruption which can use major disruptions for users ranging from airline pilots or educational institute this new capability built using declarative declarative device management protocol so earlier we using mdm protocol which is reactive declarative device management protocol which is proactive allow manage to enforce apple devices update by install to install by specific time previously admin manually change update policy right to rely on third party software however they were unable to configure specific mac os update the only option was latest update right if you if you have seen i have made video on this uh, how you can up create a update policy right if you don't you, know, you can you can see here uh, i have already how you can create a mac how you can create an update policy for mac operating system devices right so you can watch this video and you you will see uh, uh, how you can create the policy for apt mac updates okay uh, they they have no control over the timing of the update and couldn't prevent them from interrupting users but with this new capability with this declarative device management the device is aware of the update deadlines set by the admin and natively handle the update downloads preparation and installation admin can also specify the help url which is display with the update in the system setting this allow organizations to provide powerful information such as 
that specifies of the update deadlines, expected number of prompts and instructions for saving data before a forced device restart. So if you want to learn more about DDM, you can watch this video from Apple. I will put this link and see how actually being as an IT administrator, you can get this right tool to your um, to manage your organization devices and with the with the latest technology which is called declarative device management including the software update device management asset type and all other you can see our or you can uh, go for the any any uh, any uh, on any internet site and you can see this 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 refresh setting catalog will actually will also change how feature updates are delivered to your apple devices so beginning with these setting subjects the microsoft is actually excited to release this software update enforcement specific configurations declarative software soon in the setting catalogs admin can able to specify the os update to install by enforced deadline on supervised devices right so you can only update to the supervised devices so I have already made video how you can configure this, how being as admin, how you can aspire the OS updates, right? So this new configurations highlight the power of setting catalog we, the Microsoft has designed for the futures with the built-in declarative device management support. It also spotlight the power of DDM where the device handle when the download and prepare the updates and when to prompt users that an update is being enforced on the devices. It ensures the update is installed on the deadline right additionally apple announced new status item for declared device management provide rich updates reporting in the near real time so if i go to here i i, I will just quickly show you if i go here and you will see the apple operating system update policy right you will see i have already created if not just let's get created quickly so apple ddm okay and you see here the select version is latest update right so this is the traditional mdm now it's built in and you see update and check in so what is this you can select this one and 17.1 or you want to just install this one and select this during schedule time and define this this is what we the, the microsoft has made right declarative update so you can declare when actually your devices will update during the serial time or outside the serial time or the day time and everything this is how you can update so i hope you learn uh, what is ddm and how it has been inbuilt with your intune and how you can use this through this policy okay try this method and keep learning till then thank you have a good day